Hello everyone, today's video is very special for me because this makes me remember when I first started in AM radio back in 1991. At that time, I just got out of college and I studied in the summer uh, for to pass my AM exam and I passed it in November 1991 and I graduated in uh, May 1991. I remember at that time that I didn't have any uh, steady job, so I was, you know, jumping from job to another to contracts, and I couldn't afford pretty much, you know, equipment at that time. So uh, well, I had to rely on a friend, which I salute is Sylvain Victor Echo Tree Tango Delta Golf, which lent me some equipment at that time so I can do radio, and I started to buy stuff. But at that time, I also remember looking and buying some magazine, okay, about AM radio. And I remember seeing old publicity uh, about a mechanical clock that had the gray line on it and the map, the world map for AM radio. And I remember at that time seeing that price it was very expensive. It's still expensive today. But I remember thinking this is the ultimate luxury item that you can add to your shack and in my future dream shack i think and i thought sorry that this was going to be an equipment that has to be in my shack last year when i rebuilt my shack as you can see now and i'm lucky enough today to have a successful career and having all those those fancy gear and i wanted to recreate a dream shack for you guys and if you look back at those videos, I was looking for something special to put in the shack. And I remember that when I was younger and started in AM radio about the Geoshron clock. I didn't remember exactly the name of that product. But after Googling it and searching for a little while, I found it. It's the Geoshron. And I also found something else. I found out that they made a digital version that you can actually hook up on a 4K TV. And digit the digital version includes all kind of fancy new stuff that you don't have on the mechanical clock. Still, the mechanical clock, which has 300 moving parts in it, is a piece of jewelry for AMP, the ultimate thing you can have in your shack if you can afford it. But now, with the digital 4K version, it is a lot more affordable for most of us and you can actually hook it up. I have it now on the HD monitor, but I will show you how it looks like on a 4K uh, TV. And it's absolutely amazing. The color are wonderful. The maps are great. The information is great. You even have the um, space station uh, orbiting where it is, and this is live, okay? And you can see the gray line uh, everywhere. You can see where the suns come up, where the suns come down and you can actually see this in real time and it's moving with the clock and it's absolutely great it's so wonderful so i just wish you know maybe in the future i have a, a 40 uh, 43 inch mo uh, t monitor tv that i use for my 4k um, pc to do the editing and i'm monitoring myself on it right now but i hope someday to put something in the corner there maybe another 40 inch TV right in the corner close to the, to the uh, ceiling so I can have the Geoshron install on it. So when I saw that they've made the 4K digital version, I contacted Geoshron, but it was back order, it was very popular. But as soon as it got back uh, available, uh, I was contacted and I got the Geoshron 4K. And uh, this is absolutely great. So we will go through the product and uh, hope this will, uh, you know, you will like that addition to my shack. So I'm still planning new stuff in there. I want to move things around. I got things right here. Hold on. I got things like this here, which is a speaker from Palstar that is actually matching the size of my MB1 that I want to use. So I will be reshoveling the shack again to uh, try to make it uh, to look good as possible. So let's go to the review. When you get the Geoshron, it's actually very well packed. You get two box 
in the box and an HDMI cable. In the little box there is a mouse that is included, a USB mouse, just to set up your device. In the bigger box you get the unit itself, very nice, it's a small PC, dedicated PC, and you get all the port there, you can plug it Ethernet, but there is Wi-Fi, you get the manual, the quick setup, and a remote. Into the remote there is a dongle that you need to put in a USB port, okay, like this to use the remote and there is included battery. When you boot up the device you get this nice wonderful color screen. But first let's go into the menu and set it up. As you can see mine is already set up on AM radio but you have different type of maps that you can select by just changing it like this. You use the remote to completely uh, go through the menu but you can also use the mouse that it's included. So let's go back to AM radio. You can change the time scales from 12 hour to 24 hour. And uh, please, uh, this video was recorded filming my giant 70 inch 4K TV. So I have no equipment to do screen capture directly uh, into the, this device. So I needed to do this, but it looks very, very nice, but it's still better in person when you see it on a 4K screen. I just started the demo. The demo is showing you the full year round uh, summer solstice that you just saw and uh, the way the sun is going through and then you can see all the daylight uh, and the night time uh, every time of the year. So on the night time you can see the human lights. That is very very nice and look at the wonderful color. So you see the full year in a short moment and uh, this demos the equinox and the solstice, and now you have the summer solstice. As you can see, it is brighter up north, then it change, and in fall it is brighter down south. So this demo runs for a little while, and it's going to stop very soon. So let's go back to the menu, as you, you can. On each menu tab you also have a tutorial that you can use and you can change the night opacity I like it when it's very dark but you can change it as you can see there it is you can actually have a more defined terminator line but I prefer the soft one because it gives you the gray scale uh, the gray line sorry uh, of the daylight that is very neat and you have the human lights opacity so you can have it brighter. I will leave it on one. Okay. And you have the shipping link that you can add like this. I'm going to turn it off. And you can also have the hair traffic that you see here. Showing similar image. There you go. You can see how it looks like. Then you have the Analma, which is showing you the saltis. There it goes. You can turn it on and off. Okay, so it was on by default. Now you see it's off. Now we'll turn it on. There you go. And it's back on. Now you can see it in more detail as I'm showing you. There you go. So this is telling you which season you are on and where the sun is in this cycle, full year cycle. Then you can have like, uh, you can pin some coordinates over there or you can also turn on and off the International Space Station as you can see there. It's very nice. So you can see where it is. In the setup, you can set up your Wi-Fi. The first thing you should do is that. And then you can enter the time configuration, reset to factory default and as all menu tab you can get the demo the, the uh, tutorial sorry then you can also update the system when I receive it update itself but now it has the current version and you can safely power it down look at this nice screen don't you think it's wonderful so this concludes this review 
if you enjoy and you would like to have your own GeoShram, you can actually get it from international dealer or local dealer. I know that in Canada, Radial has some, and they also have it in the new product list, uh, the 4K digital version. Also look in your country where you can buy it. You can buy it online as well. And uh, this thing is absolutely amazing and what a great addition to your shack. It's wonderful and I'm so happy that I have one now. So if you have dreams, if you have a dreams of building a dream shack like I do, well, this is a unit that you probably will want in your shack. On this, I'll say 73 and catch you some other time.